Patriots at the Dolphins in our prime cut. And you know it's a big game when The Rock shows up. You can put the smell with The Rock's cooking, right? And it's hot, humid, actually a little hotter and more humid at this time of year than you might expect. And there's the number we just told you. So the Patriots kicked a field goal early, Vinatieri, 3-0. Brady fumbles on a quarterback sneak, and the Dolphins recover. This would be Bill Belichick is doing it with mirrors. He's lost seemingly half of his starters. Jay Fiedler to Chris Chambers. Time has come today. Six-yard touchdown, 7-3 Miami. Yeah, Chambers does a great job of getting inside, and what a small window Fiedler had to fit that ball in. Great throw as well. Next Patriots possession is a draw to Kevin Falk. It's a pretty good run until Brock Marion strips him, keeps working on the ball. Dolphins defense forces the turnover, and uh, the Dolphins lead it 10 to 3. Now, late third, Brady gets good feel back there. Tommy avoids the sack, and this is Dion Branch from Louisville. Louisville. Yep, first down. Well, you talk about the pocket presence. Now, there's a, a you know, he, he could have taken the ball and pulled it down. He decided that he had an opportunity to throw it. Great job of hanging in the pocket. And then Brady to David Gibbons, 24 yards, and all of a sudden, the Patriots late third have tied the game at 13. And again, both, all these throws by these quarterbacks in a small window, receivers knowing that they're going to get hit. Gibbons right there, great job of concentrating on catching and securing the football. So now, fourth quarter tied at 13. Fiedler. To the gifted Randy McMichael for the first down. That was on third and ten. Here's third and five. Fiedler to McMichael. First down. Then on first, it's Fiedler to, I think you get the picture, it's McMichael. Eight catches for 102. First down. All the way up to the 32 now. Where's Ricky? Well, the Patriots did a good job on Ricky Williams. 27 carries for 94. But tough run for the first time. How does he stay on his feet? Well, he just got great strength and he's got great balance, but anytime you give Bill Belichick a chance to, you know, draw up a game plan to stop one guy, focus you to be kind of one-dimensional, he's, there's no one better at it in this league. Well, there was the big play there. Orlando Mari trying a 35-yard field goal off the dirt, and it's blocked by big Richard Seymour and the Patriots push up front. And so, the special teams play, we go to overtime. The Patriots as the visitors have the call. Oh boy, don't don't tell me we're gonna have one of these <laughs> on Thanksgiving. I'll explain what happened today in a moment. Well, it plays in there. Heads is the call. He said heads, it is a tails. Uh, we will explain this afterwards. The, the Patriots thought they'd won the toss. Referee Jerry Austin said they didn't win the toss. This is Thanksgiving, but it, it, it was Thanksgiving for Miami because all of a sudden they have it. And now, Fiedler. Oh, are you kidding me? To Darius Thompson with a great grab. So Miami in business. And now, you know, because the Marlins are playing baseball, it's off the, the dirt and Olindo Mare. Oh, Mare. Wide right. <laughs> Junior can't believe it. Whoa. So later in the overtime, we're still playing. How later? After that missed kick. Right for the jugular. Brady, Troy Brown, and Van the Renown. Good go all the way. 82 yards. Patriots win. 19-13 on the bomb. This is your play, you know, so uh, I ran as hard as I could. You know, I was tired of being out there. I was getting hot. You know, my guys on defense were starting to cramp up. And, Losing guys and uh, wanted to finish it like that. The streak is over. Bill Belichick's team, which lost 31 to nothing, the first game of the year in Buffalo, is in first place. The Dolphins come to New England. They return the favor in later December. But the overtime win by New England completes an amazing, well, it doesn't complete it, but they continue an amazing comeback in a day that, with that bomb, Brady threw for 283, and the Patriots well, maybe it's all that curse of the Bambino obviously could not <laughs> go to the New England Patriots. And what that does is, well, I'll tell you what, our hammer, Hank Goldberg, caught up with the quarterback, Tom Brady. Tom, as uh, we just said, what a game. <laughs> yeah, it was unbelievable. I think uh, we're down and out a few times, but, um, you know, C came up with that big block. Then Olindo missed that uh, field goal, and Ty came with the interception, and then you hit number 80, who's done it for 
11 years now running down the field uncovered, and uh, it was a big win. What did you see on that play when Troy got open? Well, I faked the slant, and I just – offensive line bought me a lot of time. Troy got behind the defense and then let it let it go, and um, he made a great catch. Tom, one more quick thing. This team is so beaten up, you know, and yet yeah. week after week you keep losing guys, and, you, and you're and you coping with it and winning. Yeah, it's uh, – I think it's a testament to the, to the mental toughness this team has, and I think we're only going to get better the more guys we get back. But this is a, this is a big step in the right direction. Thanks, Thanks guys. a lot. Okay, back to the studio.